Hey guys, John P with Geek Beat TV. We're still doing live coverage here at CES 2013. Hey, you want to see Cali dance? Thanks to Ford for powering our CES coverage. Okay, that's not really Cali, but that is Cali, and let me tell you what's going on. She is playing a game that is it's being powered by Extreme Motion from a company called Extreme Reality, and she's playing it by dancing in front of the webcam on this little ThinkPad. The cool thing about this technology is it takes any 2D webcam and it translates the motion of the person in front into what you see here. So you see the little panda is basically mirroring everything that she's doing over there. Now this is technology that's being developed that should be deployed, that can be deployed in any kind of game or application, but the first instances are showing up in the Samsung Windows 8 uh, online platform, so you can go in there and you can download some of these games, try them out with your own webcams, and that's it, that's it for the update. We're just gonna watch Kelly dance now. You guys stay tuned for more Geek Beat. Go to youtube.com forward slash geekbeatv and how about a thumbs up for Dancing Kelly. Hey, did you know that NPR's award-winning public radio app is one of the many apps that you can control with your voice via Ford Sync App Link. Connect a supported mobile phone to your Ford vehicle via Sync App Link, and before you know it, you're going to be able to stream local news, listen to your favorite programs like Morning Edition and All Things Considered, and navigate through custom playlists, all using simple voice commands. Sync App Link is yet another example of how Ford is going further to keep you connected on the go. Thanks so much to Ford for powering our CES coverage.